For some people, when they graduate high school and head off to college, they never look back. But one musician says he always felt the call of his high school. So after he earned his degree, he came back with a very special purpose. It's a great example of what's right with our schools. Give me that, oh, my spirit. For Jalil Wright, this is home. Uh, I still feel surreal. He graduated from High Point Central High School in 2014 and says he always dreamed of coming back to teach music. I've always had that vision. Like, I told my former director, I said, you know, I'm going to be in your shoes, you know, when I graduate. You know, but it's just band is something I've always had a passion about. So ever since high school, I took it serious. He wants to encourage other kids to give it a try, too. That's why he loves opening their eyes to the possibilities. A lot of them have never played or have little experience. So for them to be able to play a note and it actually sounds, you know, decent, and the smile that they gave me just lit up. And it made me smile, too. If they mess up, they say, hey, Mr. Wright, what can I do to fix it or what can I do to get better? Can you show me? what I can do to be better, you know, and the fact that they want to get better. He's building a foundation for this. Hey, hey. The Marching Sounds of Distinction, High Point Central's marching band. My love is truly marching band. In just a matter of months, he's built the band from the ground up. I think we're up to 30 members now, from zero to 30. Uh, we're still recruiting. In the meantime, they're practicing. But after school is when we get down to the nitty gritty, when we get down to, to the fun part, as the kids say. As they march around the school in the neighborhood, people are taking notice. One, two, it's been years since they heard any music coming from outside these walls. And when the Friday night lights come on, they aren't the only thing to shine. So does the marching sounds of distinction. <laughs> He tells the band this is only the beginning. The best is yet to come. Then it's just because of the exposure that it gives you. Like a lot of kids haven't been out of North Carolina, haven't been out of High Point. So when with band we travel various places for competitions, football games, anything we travel. So like it gives them something to look forward to outside of what they're used to looking to every day. He knows his students have potential and he's ready to help them grow. Like I feel like what I'm doing is worth it and I feel like I'm doing my job the correct way. I love it. I enjoy what I do. I love my kids. Mr. Wright says he owes a lot to his assistant directors who help with the band. And you may notice the band wasn't wearing uniforms, but it wasn't due to the heat. There was a problem with the uniforms and the manufacturer that they have. So they're currently looking at raising money to buy windsuits that they can wear.